The Great Commission. Jesus went to see the disciples after he had been raised from the dead. They buzzed with excitement. Is that you, Jesus? We're so glad to see you. Do you want something to eat? Jesus smiled. Peace be with you, he said. I have things to tell you. The disciples gathered close around Jesus, eager to listen to him. Jesus began, God has given me all the power in heaven and earth. The disciples looked at each other and began chattering again. Whoa, wonderful. We knew it. Fantastic. What will you do first? Wait, Jesus said. There's more. The disciples listened carefully. Go everywhere in the world and teach people about me. And remember, I will always be with you. Jesus returned to heaven. The happy disciples soon began the work Jesus had told them to do. Imagine if God gave you a job to do. One day, Jesus' friends found themselves walking up a hill to meet him, which surprised them, as not long before then, he'd been dead. But Jesus was always surprising. They'd spent three years with him and seen him do so much. They'd seen him... Are you ready? <gasps> Heal the sick, the lame, and Simon's mother, even the people that no one else liked, raise people from the dead, care for children no one else thought were important, talk about the kingdom of God, calm a storm, feed thousands of people, twice, walk on water, say he was the savior of the whole world, warn he would suffer and die, go to Jerusalem, surrounded by large crowds, curse a victory, teach a lot, kick out the temple merchants, condemn the teachers of the law, say he would come back again, predict his betrayal, be arrested, heal an ear, be sentenced to death, get ridiculed, be nailed to a cross, killed and buried. <gasps> So, Jesus' friends hadn't expected to meet him again. But there he was. Jesus had risen from the dead. His friends and followers were amazed. They praised God and worshipped him, although some doubted. And Jesus said, I have been given all authority in heaven and on earth. Go then to all peoples everywhere and make them my disciples. Baptize them in the name of the Father, the Son and the Holy Spirit and teach them to obey everything I have commanded you. And I will be with you always, to the end of the age. Jesus did all this for us, and now he has given us a job to do with the help of his Holy Spirit. So, are you ready? <gasps> This Leviticus, Numbers, Deuteronomy, Joshua, Judges, Ruth, First and Second Samuel, First and Second Kings, First and Second Chronicles, Ezra, Nehemiah, Esther, and Job, Psalms and Proverbs, Ecclesiastes, Song of Solomon, Isaiah, Jeremiah, Lamentations, Ezekiel, Daniel, and Hosea. Obadiah, Jonah, Micah, Nahum, Habakkuk, Zephaniah, Haggai, Zechariah, Malachi. It's a letter from God that sets everyone free, a gift for you. Exodus, Leviticus, Numbers, Deuteronomy, Joshua, Judges, Ruth, First and Second Samuel, First and Second Kings, First and Second Chronicles, Ezra, Nehemiah, Esther, and Job, Psalms and Proverbs, Ecclesiastes, Song of Solomon, Isaiah, Jeremiah, Lamentations, Ezekiel, Daniel, and Hosea. Obadiah, Jonah, Micah, Nahum, Habakkuk, Zephaniah, Haggai, Zechariah, Malachi. It's a letter from God that sets everyone free, a gift for you, for me.